Bell Medical is excited to introduce the Warrior Blood and Fluid Warming System from Q and Flow. We uh, have a truly new technology to introduce to the marketplace that competes incredibly well compared to the water bath systems or the hot plate systems that are currently available. The Warrior actually uses a disposable unit that has stainless steel tubing uh, that is connected to sensors that is monitored by the processor hundreds of times a second. And it's constantly reading whether there's changes in temperature occurring and thus changes in flows. So this system automatically adjusts to the rate of flow to deliver a 38 degree C consistent temperature to the patient. So that's the key to our technology is a stainless steel coil that is uh, monitored uh, significantly or continuously and adjusted to adjust the temperature. So what I've done is I've created a, a simulation system here where I have ice water in an IV bag, I have the Warrior AC unit, and I have a disposable, uh, a compact disposable unit that's connected to the system. Uh, what I would do is use any IV tubing, so you don't need to use any specialized tubing, and I would prime my line. After I've primed my line, uh, I would uh, connect it to the disposable unit and then prime through the disposable unit. And what's nice about this system is I have basically 18 inches uh, from the warming component of the Warrior system. So basically I have uh, two feet of uh, cable here and a four foot extension. So I have a total of six feet that I can extend to the patient and have this attached to the uh, bed or rail of the system next to the patient's arm. So the blood warming is occurring here. The processor is controlling it here. And I have basically 18 inches that possibly could cool off and I'm delivering warm fluids directly to the patient. Okay, so let's take a look at how this system would work. First of all, as I've primed the system uh, and I'm feeling ice cold water coming from my bag of ice water, I can then turn on the system with the flip of one button. It turns on the system and then basically I start the flow. And what's actually occurring is it's sensing a change in flow. And it's uh, basically making adjustments hundreds of times a second to that stainless steel coil and basically in a matter of five seconds or so, uh, less than 11 seconds, it delivers warm fluids at body temperature, 38 degrees. So I'm feeling it now at 38 degrees or it's warm. So it's gone from ice water to uh, warm uh, fluids in a matter of seconds. Uh, that is the Warrior AC unit that would be in an operating room. But what's nice about our system is it's module and portable and has battery operation. So I can have a battery stored on the system to be able to access at any time. I can open up the Warrior system and actually open up to the actual Warrior itself. And this is a device that can be uh, portable. So I can take this off. and I can connect it to a battery and now it will do three liters to five liters of fluid on one battery charge. Now I'm delivering it through there and we're still delivering fluids at uh, 38 degrees. Now I can transfer to the PACU or to the ICU. Uh, the same kind of handoff can be done uh, uh, without uh, transporting the device by just unplugging at the disposable unit. So basically I can unplug here, go into the PACU or to the uh, uh, ICU and have another Warrior AC uh, unit plugged in and all I have to do is plug in that cable into the uh, device. Once that's plugged in, it immediately starts working, and then I'm guaranteed my consistent 38 degrees C. So basically, what I'm able to do with the Warrior AC unit is do traditional uh, warming of blood and fluids in the operating room. I have the option of transporting it with a Warrior or with a second Warrior that you might own with a battery. And I also have the ability of using the Warrior in an ambulance, a helicopter, in the emergency department, uh, all the way up to trauma and into the OR. The flow rate, warming rate of the Warrior allows me to warm fluids up to 200, ice cold fluids up to, two, to 38 degrees, up to 290 mLs per minute. If I have warm fluids, I can actually go up to 500 mLs per minute. So the Warrior AC has the capability of warming your fluids and blood in a maximum uh, capacity and maximum flow rate that you would use that would be comparable to other uh, very expensive systems. 
So that's the Warrior AC and the Warrior uh, and the Warrior uh, uh, Compact Disposable Unit. Thank you for your attention.